There's been an old saying that goes back a number of years. Rules for thee, but not for me. And that seems to be the case when it comes to um, Disney and stars of their projects. Remember, you got to go back to 2021. Gina Carano was dismissed from Disney, from Lucasfilm, for a political post on Instagram. And since then, or even before her dismissal, time and time and time and time and time again, her male co-stars or stars of Lucasfilm projects, even Marvel projects, have made political statements, but yet none of them has, have been dismissed for their political statements on social media. So what's interesting is Mark Hamill, Luke Skywalker, probably the biggest character slash star of all time when it comes to projects put out by Lucasfilm. Certainly in the Star Wars universe. I mean, I don't think anybody could argue that. If you have a differing opinion, comment down below. Just to refresh some memories here. 2021, Gina Carano puts a post out on Instagram. Disney terminates her. Begins a smear campaign against her. Her agents drop her. Publishes drops her. She's left out on her own. Fast forward to 2024. She files a lawsuit against Disney over her termination. That was back in uh, February. Fast forward to July. The judge says this lawsuit can go to trial. It can move forward, which leaves Disney open to a whole bunch of, um, we'll just say things, stuff. Because the main thing about this lawsuit was getting to discovery. Why do we want to get it to discovery? Because that's where all or most of the dirty laundry is going to be aired out that Disney could be hiding, concealing, whatever. That's usually where some truths come out about the company. So let's fast forward now to August, D23. A new Star Wars Lego project is announced where Mark Hamill is going to be involved with it. Called Lego Star Wars Rebuild the Galaxy. Mark Hamill is going to be producing. He's going to be voicing Luke Skywalker. Now, over on GinaCarano.net, over on X, they post a big congratulations to at Mark Hamill on returning to Lucasfilm Projects. Question mark. How come you're able to continue to get work? Have you been disciplined for your social media posts that are highly political? At Gina Carano was public, publicly fired for doing the exact same as you. Yeah, exactly. A uh, drunk 3PO. Hey, Mark Hamill, congrats on the new Lego movie. Quick question. You post a lot of political stuff. And if you remember, Gina Carano was fired from Lucasfilm for posting political stuff. Are you not worried that you might be fired as well? Or has Disney said you're okay? May the force be with you. And this here just exhibits the double standard. Rules for thee, but not for me. And quite honestly, in my humble opinion, this is just going to add to the fuel to the lawsuit that Gina Carano has against Disney. Remember, this is supposed to come to trial, um, I think, September 2025. I think the discovery phase is supposed to happen... I think the deadline was set of April, 2025. You, you better, you can bet your bottom dollar that 
Mark Hamill's statements he's made on X will be brought up as part of this trial. You can bet your bottom dollar that Pedro Pascal's statements that he's put out there on social media, whether it be X, Instagram, Facebook, whatever, are going to be included as part of this trial. You can bet even somebody on the Marvel side of things, such as Mark Ruffalo, his statements are going to be brought in as part of this trial. It's going to be interesting to see how this plays out. I, I mean, folks, get your popcorn. This one, this is going to be interesting the next, say, 12 months or so. So there you got it, or there you have it. Um, the double standard that exists. And this just isn't in Hollywood. This is everywhere, folks. This is in everyday life. This is in sports. This is in business. You're going to have double standards everywhere. But this just highlights the double standard that some individuals face in Hollywood. So leave a comment. Tell me what you think. While you're at it, please take the time to smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss a video. Thank you to everybody that takes the time out of their day to, to watch my videos, watch my content. Subscribing, hitting the like button, so on and so forth. That just helps out the channel. That supports me and what I'm doing. Helps me continue to do this. And um, share this video out there with your friends and family. And with that, I will see you guys later.